And then what another team that's going to dominate Drive to Survive is going to be McLaren because we started from the literal bottom with Lando Norris having six pit stops at Bahrain. What do you mean? That's not good. I think that's bad. No, I think they'll do a whole, like, again, the way that they frame it, I think they'll do a whole episode on McLaren and the turnaround, um, you know, from (laughs) six pit stops to actually making podium. Um, Yeah. I think think McLaren will get its own episode. I really do. I would like an Oscar Piastri highlight reel. He had an incredible (laughs) um, rookie season. So I would really like to see... A lot on Oscar Piastri. I would also like to just see Zach Brown make a fool of himself with anything he says. Just anything. I want to hear Honestly, his thoughts on Daniel coming back. Oh my God, Catherine. Yes. Yeah. I, I oh. want to know his thoughts. Like, I want a side by side of Zach Brown versus Christian Horner and how, like, how, you know, how they had to, like, re educate Daniel and, like, break him out of those bad driving habits that, that Christian and that Red Bull people have implied were some of the issues that, that Daniel had when he was at McLaren. Um, I, I don't know how, if, if I've talked about this much on the podcast, but I, I, I personally feel that, like, Daniel Ricardo and the terrible, horrible, no good, very bad career decisions really started when he decided to leave Red Bull. Um, he had some legitimate reasons and didn't have a terrible time at Renault. Renault was just going through a rebrand, um, which is one of the reasons why he he left to go to McLaren. But, you know, he should have stayed at Red Bull. Yeah. Hot take. Yeah. I mean, I think, and I've heard this on another podcast or in an interview that I don't remember what was said, but, or who it was with, but there were some people in his ear and that's why he left and whatever. Oh, definitely. um, And I think that's why he left both times anyways. um, Yeah. But no, I really, I want to just hear Zach, how he feels about having to pay Daniel $18 million <laughs> Yeah, he's driving for another team. <laughs> yeah. It's one thing to pay a guy $18 million to, to, you know, sit in a simulator for a season, but then Nick DeVries had to go and get fired. <laughs> How's it feel to have uh, your second highest paid driver driving for a different team? <laughs> <laughs> driving for Alpha Tauri. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, so I want some um some good Zach Brown quotes. I don't know. He's just like yeah. he makes himself just seem and come across so douchey sometimes. I love to like hear how the whole Vegas betting like race and fight thing came about. I don't know if we'll actually yeah. get that, but it'd be interesting to hear from him about that. So I don't yeah. know. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. 